Leslie, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, please do consider subscribing. Don't forget to like, share this video, comment down below if you have any suggestions on what to do in my next vlog, and please, please do not forget to click the notification bell to be updated for more of my upcoming videos. Alright, so for today's video, I am going to do a What's on My Money Organizer vlog. Not too long ago, I purchased this one on a certain shop that I came across on, not really came across, but I saw this my day from a friend of mine. Her name is Julia Gaspai, and I was really, really, really amazed. And it's just so it's cute. That's why I really decided to ask her where she bought it. And then she gave me instructions and here it is. All right, so the purpose of this vlog is that I am going to give you an idea or an insight and of course to help you, you know, reach your financial goals in life. Now having a money organizer gives you control over your money. It helps you focus on your financial goals and it also keeps track of your spending. It keeps you on top of what you're spending and on top of that, it makes it easier for you to stay away from your debts and of course your savings. It separates your bills from your savings and of course it organizes your money. It separates your savings from your debts shopping, groceries, bills, and whatnot. Having this is really, really, really useful and very important for you to budget your money and keep track of your spending and of course, reach your financial goals in life. Okay, I know sharing you guys with this kind of content is a little bit of a private thing, but you know, I just want to share with you guys and you know give you an idea of how to keep track of your spending and how to manage or budget your money all right so I have here my very own money organizer with my name on it Leslie it has my favorite color purple or lavender whatever okay the first thing you see when you open your money organizer is a little compartment here so you can put your BPI card your bank account card your Gcash and of course your personal IDs valid IDs all right so first compartment it has here business so you can put your business money on here actually this money that I put here is already my profits that I gain in my business. Like, you know, I resell goodies and all of that stuff. So, yeah. Okay, this one is groceries. So you can separate your money and put it in your groceries compartment. Here we have bills. See? So you can put here your electricity bill, water bill, whatever, Netflix bill, all of that stuff, you can put it here on your bills compartment. Okay, next we have bank. So I only have 500 here. I usually put all of my savings money in my bank account, so I don't have much to put here. Just extra, extra. Okay, the last one, we have here shopping so sometimes when you want something or need something not just need but something that you like so you have your own money for online shopping if you want that stuff so you have to separate something for your shopping spree <laughs> right so I think that's pretty much it we have here one, two, three, four, five. Five compartments for the money and for your personal things here on the front page. And on the back page, you can page. <laughs> you can put here something like a gift card, a gift certificate. So I have here a gift certificate from I don't know, Moon Cafe. 
So when we went to Dumaguete with my family, we ate there and our bill was like almost 2000 So they gave us a gift card when your bill reaches up to 1000 So you have at least, I don't know how much this is, uh, 50, just 50 pesos. But still, you've got something, a uh, little bit of... Uh, discount right when you go back there you have a gift card you can show to the waiter and you know have some discounts all right so i think that's pretty much it it's very important to have your own money organizer so that you can keep track of your spending and of course manage your money Oh, by the way, I almost forgot it. So I bought this money organizer from a shop called LM Merch. And they have a Shopee account. They also have a Facebook page and an Instagram page. I will put all the links in the description box below to where you can open it and order one of yours. Alright, that's it guys. Thank you so much for watching um, for our shoutouts. 2,000 years later. Okay, shout out to Joe Johnson Dilag from Bayawan City. Hello. Shout out to um, Dodong Tintin Mirata, my avid follower and subscriber. Hello. Earl John Kalago Konise. I'm sorry um, if I pronounced your last name wrong. But hello, Earl John Kalago Kalago Konise. That's it for today guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment down below if you have any suggestions or like to do in my next vlog, share this video, and click the notification bell to be updated for more of my upcoming videos. Bye!